don't always see the night. They say they want a real one. They say they want a real one to make a feel, yo. Hey yo, what's good family? Welcome back to Astronauty for another video. Today we're actually gonna be covering the full drop list for week five at this point. This is the Lacoste week, but I did cover that in yesterday or two days ago's video. So I am gonna cover the full drop list in today's video. We're gonna talk about some of the resale for this week and some of my favorite items, the ones that I'm personally gonna be going for. Let me know if you guys do end up enjoying this video by slapping a like on it down below. That definitely would mean a lot. Subscribe to the channel if you are new and would enjoy more of this type of content. Click those post notification bells so you're notified each and every time I post a new video. And hey, you might go ahead and be shouted out right here with the post notification gang. All you have to do is comment down below, post notifications, something you like about the video, something you feel like I can do better. And don't forget to click that Gleam link at the top of the description if you want to enter in a Supreme Smoke Tea giveaway. Now, without any further ado, man, let's go ahead and get straight into this video. So today we're actually going to be covering every item that has nothing to do with the collab. I'm going to talk about the collab at the end because i feel like i already covered it as per usual we're gonna start from the bottom of the list with the dookiest items including this flannel shirt right here bro i see why this is at the bottom of the list like why i don't understand why this pattern like it just looks atrocious in my opinion maybe i'm wrong i know i'm not wrong bro this shit looks retarded this looks like something you find in the flea market and i wouldn't buy it even there so it's like nah i'm not even really trying to say too much about this we're gonna go to the zigzag beanie right here this is okay i don't think it's something that i would personally wear this looks like the beanies that you put on your baby when they're newborns honestly it doesn't look too bad in that black and gray color but it's still nothing too special for me to go out the way and even try to consider this item to be honest so i might leave this one right there that is gonna retail for 34 dollars as well so it's a dub next up we got this heaven jaguar short sleeve this one is actually pretty cool but i need to see what it says like what the pictures are saying on this shit because normally when they do these all over prints they say some crazy ass shit that i really don't want to have on a shirt so i'm about to actually look at it real quick i don't know like i really don't know bro all i see is beloved and a whole bunch of other shit i don't know if it's good or bad i'm gonna leave this shit right there regardless though retail for this one is like a hundred dollars they're literally smoking cocks on that i'm not even trying to go near that shit now we do have a lacoste item but i am going to talk about that at the end we do got this god's favorite short sleeve work shirt it's basically one of those supreme like working at the auto body shop type shirts it's, it has a little name tag that says supreme right there then on the back it says god's favorite and like this 70s styled font it's like a bubble type font it's not bad but it's just nothing over the top and it is gonna retail for 128 if you're considering buying this over the lacoste collab <laughs> reconsider bro like it just doesn't make no sense unless you're really gonna wear this to work or like for the personal just don't get it next up we got this drama short sleeve top which is actually not bad i do like a couple colorways in this but i am interested in seeing like what color the drama print is on some of these other tees because the navy one has the baby blue i know the green has the purple which is honestly pretty fire but i do want to see what the other colors have on it i'm pretty sure that the heather gray one has like a red font because that's the one that one of the skaters wore but this one right here is one of the items that you go ahead and buy if you can't get the collab or honestly if it's something that you would rather go for you can go ahead and go for it you already know how it is but we do have a lot of lacoste stuff coming up i'm gonna talk about that at the end like i said we do have this camel corduroy camp cap i feel like if this wasn't corduroy shit would be hard but once again it's camel corduroy i don't know bro i don't know how to feel about it because the texture on it is probably probably weird the corduroy kind of throws me off if this was a canvas hat i would definitely go for that navy with the blue type shit we do have this unseen snap front jaguar jacket this is okay it's basically one of those all over print supreme jackets that has it like in this slanted diagonal type print i guess this is cool but it's, it just looks like a button up shirt it doesn't even look like a jacket honestly this is something i would definitely skip on and if i were to get it i would probably go for like that tan color or the black one because you could wear Wear those with mostly everything and it's a little bit more subtle than the other ones but the orange one isn't bad either but i am gonna skip on this item in general i honestly only like one of the lookbook items dropping this week and it low-key might be the item that i go for over the lacoste collab because it's one of the pieces that i've been waiting for honestly and it is this cop car hoodie right here my favorite color for this one definitely has to be that lime green color or the burgundy ones those are the best colorways in my opinion those are the ones that i would go for i 
feel like resale for this is probably not even there to be honest but it just looks fire like i honestly been waiting for this hoodie ever since i saw the lookbook i'm pretty sure i actually spoke about it on the lookbook video that i made and i said that the lime colorway had to come home with me one thing that i do hate is the fact that they dropped this hoodie on a fire ass week so it's like damn do i go for this or do i go for lacoste or do i break the bank and just get everything on this bitch i don't know what i'm gonna end up doing i'm gonna probably try to get lacoste if i take the l on that hopefully these shits are still sitting but this is one of the best items coming out so i honestly don't know what to do i feel like this is the item that i want to go for but i'm also tempted to get the lacoste hoodie which is something that i want to talk about as well now that i covered the whole drop list i'm gonna go ahead and talk about my favorite pieces from the lacoste collaboration i'm gonna talk about whether i feel like they're gonna have resell or not i feel like the one item that for sure or will have resell is definitely this hoodie right here probably in two colorways i would say that baby blue colorway is going to be the first to go for sure that's the most beautiful one like if i had a choice to pick the one that i could buy without any sellout times or anything like that it would definitely be the baby blue one i just love the way that the green meshes with that baby blue then you got like that royal blue supreme behind it it's fire a lot of people have been saying that they don't like the lacoste collabs because they feel like the branding is too subtle but honestly for me that's what i like about it the most it doesn't always have to scream supreme and in this you could kind of see it but it's not like right in your face if that makes sense i like that baby blue colorway a whole lot personally i would go for that navy with the red it just pops too nice bro that shit pops too good i also do like that mustard color because that brick lacoste is matching with it pretty good as well as far as resale bro i feel like this piece is gonna do really good i would personally say the baby blue the navy one and since it is supreme i would definitely say that red one to Typically, they do good when it comes to Supreme. That hoodie right there is for sure gonna fly off the shelves. Like, if Supreme has been taking five minutes to even load up, this week is about to take half an hour. That's all I'm gonna say. This shit is gonna go crazy for sure. A lot of people are liking it, and I am included, bro. Like, this shit is fire. But another piece from the collab that I definitely like is the Messenger bag. Maybe that's just a personal choice, but I feel like that shit is hard, bro. I like the tan colorway. That shit grew on me a lot. The navy one with the red is obviously fire, and if I was gonna wear this for, like, everyday use if i was gonna wear this to go to college or something around that nature i would definitely buy the black one i do like the fact that they made these like a canvas material rather than like a leather or like a shiny ass leather like they did with their last collab but as far as resale goes i definitely would say the lacoste hoodie is gonna have pretty good resale i would say the cop car hoodie would have resale but i honestly don't know like that's not a guarantee because when it comes to lookbook items nowadays you typically have to hold them off because they won't do good at first this six panel hat right right here might be one that will end up doing good it's actually really high on the list for what i thought it would be it's doing pretty good as far as supreme community votes go so i wouldn't doubt if this actually does end up doing good on the resale market as far as colorways go i would definitely say the black one because it's the one that most people will be inclined to purchase and if not this might be weird but i think the pink one might do good because when it comes to supreme pink does good too and it's kind of weird bro but hey it is what it is now retail for the hat is 68 dollars that is od bro like that shit don't even make sense the bomber jacket is fire shit but i don't know if resale will be there at least at first i feel like if you hold these items down the line they definitely will grow in value that half zip puffy jacket is actually not bad retail on it is 218 i feel like this could possibly do good but it has to be like a select color a select size like that baby blue one i could see doing good maybe in like a small or a xl but i can't see every single jacket Jacket right here doing great maybe down the line because lacoste and supreme if y'all don't know them shits be going for bread like the track jacket that they did that was like white with red on it that shit is going for probably like 400 500 at this point but it is like a year or two down the line that's something that you have to think about is this something that you would mind holding or are you trying to get it off your hands quick like most of these pieces you probably will have to hold i feel like if you do resell this jacket though long term that red one would do good and that blue one is gonna do good as well i feel like maybe Maybe the sweatshorts will do good but since it is becoming winter it's gonna be cold as shit so you would probably have to hold these for summertime these are a vibe though that baby blue colorway is crazy to me i would definitely try to go for those if there wasn't a bunch of other
other shit that I was trying to get this week. But honestly, that pretty much does it for everything I had to say about this collab, everything I had to say about this week. If you guys did enjoy this video, man, leave it a like down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Click those post notification bells so you're notified each and every time I post a new video. And click that gleam link at the top of the description if you want to enter in a Supreme Smoke Tea giveaway. Now, as far as resale, I feel like that Lacoste hoodie is going to do good. The cop car hoodie might do good. Hat might also do good in a couple colorways. Besides that, maybe the messenger down the line will do good, but not at first. And I think that's pretty much it, bro. The bomber jacket is expensive as shit as is. So I don't know if that one will have too much resale markup on it. And I feel like that's pretty much it, bro. So I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. If you guys have any dreams, go ahead and follow them. Time waits for nobody. So go ahead and get out there, man. Reach as far as you can for your dreams. You have to work hard for it. I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. Peace. Stay up. And I'm out. They say they want a real one, they say they want a real one to make them feel young.